Hello class. Assessment 4.3 has a manual stock card exercise attachment. This attachment is related to the spreadsheet on page 75 of your workbook. The title of this is Manually Recording Inventory. The exercise you need to complete has a, a solution on page 192. Now this solution may or may not be correct. You will need to work out the answer yourself. Now don't just simply type the data from the given answer, okay? It really doesn't meet the purpose of the exercise is not the reason why you've been given it in the first place. The reasons are to develop your Excel skills, which is always good, to let you discover how weighted average calculation is actually constructed, and how impressive would it be if you could actually demonstrate that you understand how this is done and how you use Excel. The first row is the open balance, okay? Now, the purchase of the next rows are made at the purchase price of $325, including GST, which, if you work it out, is $325 divided by 1.1. That gives you 295.454, whatever it is, okay? Now, the important thing is that the quantity that you've actually got brought down is equal to the brought forward balance plus the amount that you purchased minus the amount that you sold. Now, this is a generic formula and will work for any future transactions, whether there is a number in that cell or not. So in this case, it is 6, which is derived from 1, plus 5, minus 0. Okay? So look at the formula bar here, where it says J11 plus D12 minus G12. So now you can construct a formula for uh, the total cost the same way. So now that you've got the total cost and the total quantity, you can work out the total weighted average cost, which is the right-hand side divided by the left-hand side. So now all you have to do is copy the formulas on J, K and L from row 12 down to as far as you like. So do you think this answer here is the same as the one that's given in the book?